Uh, it's Lucas here today to bring you a video on this Yoshiyuki Sadamoto art book, which is basically just an Evangelion art book. And it's called Carmine or Carmine or something like that, however you pronounce that. And this is what the front cover looks like with Asuka on it. And then the back here. Now, if you want to check out my other Evangelion art book, Dermond, I'll have a link in the description below if you want to check this out. But yeah, now let's get into this art book. The first page here is just the front and back covers as a widespread. Looks great. Now here's just some of the contents. If you want to pause it and take a look at this real quick, you can. Now let's get into this art book. Let's just start off with this pretty well-known widespread. Looks awesome. Another awesome... Uh, Picture here with Ray. Another one with Ray here and uh, Ava one. Yeah, I'm really glad to own uh, two Evangelion art books now. I'm not really sure which one I, I like more. I probably like Dermond more, which is the other art book that I uh, have a link in the description below for. A part of the reason why I like that one more, I think, is because it's a hardcover, where this one isn't just like a soft cover book. Oh, I really like uh, these pictures here, too. I really like it when it shows like the main characters in like different clothing than you usually see them in. Looks very cool. I wish more uh, like artists would draw their characters in like different unique clothing that you usually don't see them in. It's always cool to see. Like this looks awesome right here. It's awesome widespread. Same as this. This is like probably one of my favorite widespreads or pictures in this whole entire art book. Misato and Kaji looking awesome. Another awesome picture of Misato there. Widespread of Kaji when he was a kid with all his friends. Pen Pen. Best character, right? <laughs> now this is one of my favorites as well. It looks awesome. It's so cool seeing this in full color. It's great. Another widespread. Oh yeah, some more awesome uh, pictures of the main characters in different clothing. You usually see them in, or just different clothing you don't. Different clothing you don't usually see them in. That's what I meant to say. <laughs> But yeah, it's awesome. Some Christmas themed stuff here. Now this is a little bit of a sneak uh, preview of what's to come, of what else is in this art book. Because this also has Yoshiyuki Sadamoto's like, other works in this art book. That looks great. Now this is the DVD series. I'm not sure if these are like covers for some of the DVDs or what, but that's probably what this is. Just some pretty basic single characters. A little widespread here. Oh, is that a bit of her panties right there? <laughs> that looks awesome. Oh, that's cool. It's got like a rain in the background there. This is actually sick. Oh, dope. I would love to have a poster like this on my wall. Looks great. 
Now these are the uh, some of the artwork from the 1.0 rebuild movie. Looks awesome. The Ray looks uh, she's so cool right there. Look at her. It's like her face looks just looks awesome. Cool. Widespread of all the characters here. And another great looking picture of Ray. Now here's some art from the Girl Up Through Time and Summer Wars, which Yoshiki Sadamoto did the art for. I still need to watch this movie. Well, both both of the movies actually. But I've heard great things from them. And now Dot Hack. I've seen a bit of Dot Hack. I've never watched all the episodes though. Never really uh, got into it. But I do recognize some of these characters. It's awesome. My friend actually has a poster like this, or he used to have a wall screw like this in his room, and it was fucking huge. It took up, like, the whole wall. That actually looks really, really awesome. Looks sweet. The character designs in Dot Hack look dope. And now, Gunbuster, Die Buster. This is an anime I've been meaning to watch. Which I'll actually probably watch soon now that I have this art book. It'll, like, almost, uh, convince me to watch it sooner, I guess you should you could say. Because this inspiration, looking at this awesome art, kind of makes me just want to watch it right now. It looks sweet. It looks like a pretty wacky show, too. But yeah, if you want to check out any of my other art books, I have a playlist with all my art book videos on there. Oh, Fully Cooly. Yeah, this is the part that I was really excited for when I bought this because I have seen Fully Cooly. I own it on Blu-ray and I'm a big fan. And this is just fantastic. I had no idea that Yoshiyuki Sadamo did the art for it. But now I know and it is awesome. And then some black and white drawings from Fully Cooly. They look great. Now this is getting to the end of the art book. All that's left is some other works, as it's, they call it here. Which I have no idea what any of these are from. But it looks kind of interesting. Like, this looks like... I don't even know, some kind of mecha, but it's like, she, this chick's wearing a crown, and it like, looks like she's a princess or something, like, I don't even know. And then here, it's like some chick with a gun, there's flowers out of the gun, I don't even know what that is. And this, some girl on a bike, well, she's on an actual bike, and there's a motorbike behind her, with a gun. And her pants say whole, what does that say, Tiger? Can't really make that out. Whole something. I G R J E R. I don't know. But yeah, I'm not gonna spend too much time on this because this is like the end of the video. But yeah, my name is Lucas, and I hope you enjoyed this Yoshiyuki Sadamoto illustration book, Carmine or Carmine, however you pronounce it. But yeah, peace out.